how can we identify our calling? My pastor actually did a great video on this. And he said, basically, the reason why so many people are so confused about this is because they don't understand identity, assignment, and calling. Identity, assignment, and calling. People get those three things confused. Your identity is who you are. I am a child of God. I am Alan Parr. I am a husband. I'm a father. That is my identity. Now, what is my assignment? My assignment is to love my wife as Christ loved the church, to raise godly kids, to teach the Bible, right? This is my assignment. Your assignment in life may change many, many times, but your calling should never change. My calling is to equip the believers with the tools, training, and teaching to live the Christian life and for ministry. And I'll give you a sub call, sub calling. I am called to the people who have been mistaught and who have been, who have never been taught the word of God. So people who have been taught doctrine incorrectly and people who have never truly been taught the word of God, that's my calling. Now, how I carry that out in different seasons of my life is my assignment. So for, for many, many years, um, I was doing that by doing Wednesday night Bible studies at a small church or preaching or writing emails to people with scripture in them. That was the different assignments that I had, but my calling has always been the same. All right. So how do you identify your calling? Well, that's another, another question right there. And that was your question. Really, you got to try, um, you got to experiment. You have to try different things. First, you have to know what your gift is. What is your spiritual gift? How has God wired you? What are the things that people have affirmed you with regard to your gifting? And once you know those things, you start to just try experimenting things. So let's say you know you're gifted at teaching the Bible. Okay, so now how can I teach the Bible? Maybe I go to the prison and do it. Maybe I do it at children's ministry. Maybe I go to the nursing homes. And you just try to use your gift. And over some time, if you stay prayerful, God will eventually lead you in the path. It might take some time. For me, it took till I was 37 or 38 years old before I realized, wow, I'm, I'm, I'm called to do what I'm doing now online with ministry, right? Um, now I knew that I was called to teach the word, but um, God made it even clearer in terms of exact assignment. Right now, this is my assignment.